All right, we won't get above freezing for days. So whether you like to hunker down or go out, what do you have to have on hand? Because I blew it and forgot to get any salt. <laughs> Fox 4's Jacob Sloan has been talking to store managers around the metro now about what seems to be selling quick. So Jacob, what's flying off the shelves? Yeah, sorry to hear that, Lauren, but uh, one of the things that is flying off the shelves is uh, the rock salt. In fact, we've got some here and it's been helping us keep the ice out. Now, I will tell you some other items that have been bought, things like shovels, propane heaters, some stuff to keep you warm. And uh, stores around the area are telling us that they're ready for everybody this winter season. While it was still warm enough to enjoy the snow, Houston Hardware in Prairie Village sold out of sleds. We I had a whole bunch in the beginning and I was actually really concerned. I was like, what are we going to do with all these sleds? And then we sold them all in a day. They ordered more earlier this week and they're back on the shelves. Folks at Hy-Vee are saying the same thing. Their deliveries are still coming in. Uh, maybe uh, coming in a little later, but we have been getting all our trucks uh, as we need them and filling up and looking good. At Westlake Ace Hardware's in the metro, sales are up 90% in the past 48 hours. Customer traffic is up 60% as folks prepare for the frigid Arctic air. We love it when <laughs> the snow comes. Dan says they pay attention to the forecast to keep their shelves stocked. We had a pretty good uh, heads up on this one. So we were, you know, we were really able to fill up and take care of people. With even colder temperatures over the next few days. We'll still be here and still have everything that people need for if they do want to brave getting out. Now, I will tell you, if you haven't put rock salt out yet, Lauren, unfortunately, it's not really going to help. It really only activates and helps melt some of that ice at about 15, 20 degrees. Kevin, we did some research. There is a synthetic alternate. It says it melts up to negative 10 degrees Fahrenheit. Maybe you and I need to scatter some around uh, <laughs> Signal Hill in the problem areas here. Yeah, no, and that's going to be helpful for the next few days because we're not even going to be close to freezing for the rest of the weekend. Thank you, Jacob. Jacob Sloan live on Signal Hill here.